Hey everybody, welcome back to CS125. Today's lesson is about loops. It's about repeating things. This is the last of our presentation of core computer capabilities. We looked at manipulating and storing data. We looked at making decisions. And now we're gonna talk about how we can repeat a step in our program multiple times. Then for the rest of the week, we're gonna talk about how we put those capabilities to use to actually solve problems using computers, which is of course the core thing that makes this field so exciting and will make you so much more capable and so much more able to tackle the big problems that you find in the world once you finish it. So we'll call those algorithms, we'll start talking about them tomorrow. In the meantime though, there's one algorithm that I'm a bit concerned about because it's whatever algorithm YouTube is uh, using to choose the still shot that they use as the cover for these videos because I look nuts in a lot of them. So today's video, I thought I would try to fool those algorithms and I'm gonna use some help. So we're gonna bring Ziz and put Ziz on camera um, because cats are really cute, right? And I'm hoping that YouTube will see this cat, this adorable cat, sleepy cat, yeah, you were resting. I'll put you back where I found you. Anyway, they will see the sleepy cat and decide that this is a much better photo for the cover of this video. Welcome to today's lesson. 